Our man, yo, what's up with these revenge? Okay, we gotta get rid of her. We have to. Oh, it's three in a row. What? He's gonna keep targeting Bella. That's the problem. Been like just enough damage to get to kill my vertical. Oh my god. Okay. I really, really hope that the Nemesis proc push my Bella over the iris. Yo, yo, welcome to another video. This video is going to be a Guild War video. Um, as you can see, we are ranked 63 in Guild War, so this is not going to be an easy one. But uh, I'm going to have some fun with it. I feel like I've been uploading quite a few uh, like educational videos, so time for some fun ones, all right? So in this video, we're going old school. And you're probably wondering, old school? What do you mean by old school? Well, you might have seen by the thumbnail, but we're going back to... We're going back, like, way back. I Probably, like, 2016 or maybe even 15. I don't even know. But when Veromos first came out, every single arena defense was, like, Veromos, Bella, Vertihile. Um, It was crazy. It was fun. Uh, people had a hard time countering Veromos, uh, especially on Violent. So... We are going to be using uh, Veromos Bella Vertihile 2.0. And I, I'm just showcasing this because it's a free-to-play team that I like to use versus all of those pesky John defenses like in Siege and obviously in Guild War. So we're going to look for some here. Now, I'll be honest with you, I'm probably going to get my ass kicked, but let's have, we're, we're just going to have some fun and... This might be a one day or two day or three day video because I do want to show minimum six matches, whether I win or lose, uh, recorded live, and we'll see how it goes. I did find my first opponent, and that's a John defense, and I think we can beat it. It's all going to depend on whether we can stay out of the stuns or not. Uh, let's go. All right, so. As you saw right away, we got outsped by that uh, by that Iris. So that Iris, not only did she silence Veromo, she got the stun off too. So let's see if uh, Vertihile can cycle enough to get Veromo out and uh, maybe save us here. I know two A Bella is really good because she can strip. Except we miss it. We get resisted, and yeah, I mean we. Gets, we, we could get stunned to death uh, for sure. Ideally, I want to kill that uh, that Iris first because, you know, that's the heals, the silence, the, the stuns. But she's not um, letting me pretty much. Uh, that hug is definitely hurting here. Now we're slow. We need her almost to move to get rid of that. Luckily, I get a turn with Bella. Uh, I mean, her her 2A is pretty nice with that uh, 40%. So I would say definitely if you haven't, definitely uh, 2A Bella for sure. Nice procs from Verde. Let's get her down at least. And then, all right. Well, there's the hug again. Hopefully we can strip it this time. Let's see. Nice. Okay, we got it. So I think this is going to be a win if uh, if I can kill that uh, that Iris. I give myself some more attack buff. I mean, attack bar and the heal. I think I'll be good. But as you can see, you know, just the turn cycling from Verde uh, is pretty strong against these John comps with uh, with Veromos. Because uh, Veromos, you can you can just and let me out of this. With Veromos, his passive is so great against that provoke. You know, especially in Siege when you run out of immunity monsters and there's a whole tower of John defenses. Kind of sucks. Uh oh. Uh oh. Wait. Let me take off Otto because I want to use I want to use this team more. And this Vertihile was very low. All right. Yeah, I don't want to have to wait like four guild <laughs> guild battles to be able to showcase six matches. <laughs> Okay, so we got the first W on here. So shout out to Rising Tempest Guild and uh, Straight Get Lucky uh, is the player I face. Shout out to you, man. All right, you know what? Fuck it. Let's hit that. Uh, I'm just hoping that that Skogel 
doesn't one shot my Vertihile. Uh, my Veromos and the Bella should be tanky enough, but I'm not sure about the Vertihile. I think he should be. And I'll show all, all of the runes um, at the end. And actually, the bottom team looks good. I can easily counter that Orion. That's actually how I counter those Orion Kamun teams. Unfortunately, that fight's not going to make it onto this video. All right, so let's see. We we want to get a... Yeah, John is probably the scariest. Because that Skogel's not going to do much. Um, he's only going to do one rock. And that's going to be a little bit before he gets it back. We're going to try to stun it anyway. We didn't get a single stun except on Juno. Which is the one we didn't want to stun. Alright, so we're provoked. Here comes the rock. Luckily, Bella resisted the provoke. So let's try to land the defense break. We don't get it. You know, they have the resistance. Uh, Vertihal got some nice procs, though. And I will say, guys, I, I do think all of these need to be on, on violent for it to work like you want it to. If not, uh, it could be rough. All right. We are going to get another turn. Ah, she cut us. Oh, hey, yo, Skogel, chill. The hell? All right, there we go. Let's see if we can strip that. Nice. And I think we can kill. Okay, now we've got to work on the Skogel before he throws the rock up in the air because we don't want to hit him while the rock is up in the air because we'll just be reducing his cooldown and he can just chain that. He'll be pretty much like like the proc away from wiping the whole team. And uh, here, just to be safe, because he may be on violent and he could violent, violent into the rock and, the ro and drop the rock and kill Veromos and that would be bad. All right, we're getting some nice procs, luckily. And then once we kill the Skogel, I think that, uh, that Juno should not be a problem. There's no way this Juno solos us. I think this one will be fair to say that we can, in fact, auto. Uh, it got kind of a little risky with that Chandra earlier. Uh, they get that win, both teams. So, shout out to Plagued, again, from the Rising Tempest Guild. All right, so here we go. Oh, that's a fast Kamoon. Faster than the Iris. That's, uh, that's not like... Uh, Something you see every day. Okay, so I'm a little scared about the Vertihal being a little low. Uh, but I think he can survive the rock. So um, my Bella is on Nemesis. So I'm going to kind of wait to use that heal after the rock. Um, hopefully we got a stun. We didn't. Here comes the rock. So like I said, I'm going to try to wait after the rock. Okay, good. The, the Iris did not silence. My Bella, which we're looking good. Let's see if we can reduce the attack bar. We don't. Okay, now I might be in trouble. That might have been like just enough damage to get to kill my Vertihile with. Oh my god. Okay. I really, really hope that the Nemesis proc pushed my Bella over the Iris. If not, that Iris is about to kill my Verde. Oh man. Luckily it did. Uh, we should be uh, a little better in better in a better position now, but we're still not in the clear because this Kamun man. Uh, I'm not sure if it was the right choice to go after him first, but I think it was. And right there, I, I could have used skill one to heal a little, but I wanted to do some damage to him. All right, so let's reduce attack bar. Nice. Hey, yo, 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 Iris, Iris, chill, chill. Our right, yo, what's up with these revenge? Okay, we got to get rid of her. We have to. Oh, three in a row! Oh, my God. Luckily, uh, Veromo survived. Oh, God. See, and this is the power of Vertihile, guys. This is the power of the Vertihile Bella. Uh, the Vertihile gave us enough turns. Now I can heal. Um, I think even if he procs into, into the rock, uh, I should be good anyway. Uh, Bella, because of that defense break and all the turns... It's enough damage between Bella, Vertihile, and uh, Veromos. But you'll see my Veromos, he's actually on an attack build.
surprise, surprise. <laughs> and I almost forgot, uh, you definitely earned a shout out. Shout out to Jovate. Man, that was some crazy revenge procs right there with uh, with Iris. And I, I mean, I almost lost, man. So nice, nice defense, bro. That's uh, nothing but net force. And hey, man, it, it did some work. So, but uh, no, very nice defense, man. Shout out to you. All right, so we found another one, uh, another guild. I think we can beat this. So, I, you know, I see the Tian Ling, and I'm like, Dude, yeah, you know, I kind of want to fight it. Let's see uh, if we're almost gonna take down this uh, light panda. So let's go. Um, I'm trying to find something I can beat because I don't want the video to end yet. But for the next fight, I'm gonna definitely get a little riskier, so you might only get five matches on. Now that is assuming we can beat this. All right, so I think no matter what, I just gotta keep working on Tian Wing. Uh, but he's gonna get immunity up. Oh, never mind. I guess I could have maybe. Uh oh. Ah, uh, perfect timing from Veromos. Perfect. All right, so I maybe I should have used the stun just to force the the heal from the Triana. I don't know, I might have messed up. And yes, guys, uh, I mean I know that he counters <laughs> Verde highlight. I trust me, I know I know that, but I just wanted to hit it. You know, it's content. But I I mean it looks like we might be okay. He's I got him fairly low already. He's got the dot. She already healed, so she can't heal him again unless she procs. There we go. Perfect. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh, yo, 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 chill. Slow down, slow down. Yeah, you too, Vanessa. And yeah, this is Vertihal, just being Vertihal. It gives us so many turns. So it's kind of nice. Uh oh, uh oh, yo. Okay, we kill him. All right. Now, with no defense break, as long as this Vanessa doesn't go ham. And okay, yeah, especially after that heal, I think we're good. I think we're good. I think we're good. I think we're good. <laughs> now, yeah, we, we should be. We should be. Once we get this Vanessa down, I can definitely just auto it. There we go. All right, let's see. Uh, see how thick this uh Triana is. Yeah, she's taking some hits. All right, shout out to Shen Long from the Kestrel Guild. All right, so this one's a little different. You know, they got the dark lighting number. They got us revive Tyrannus. Uh, he's very tanky. So we're going to hit that one and see how it goes. All right, let's go. We get the first turn. Might as well, you know, just defense break him. My kill target is ideally the Damn, uh, you know what? <laughs> that guy's a little squishier than I imagined. But this is what I was afraid of. Uh-oh, we need the strip. If we can get rid of him now, that would be amazing. I Ideally, I was going to go for the Dark Lightning number, but looks like this Tyrannus is, is ruined a little squishy. Uh, but never mind. Oh. I think if he absorbs my defense one more time, or if he hits me with Wild Blow right here, uh, I might be in trouble. Oh, okay, maybe not. Maybe not. Yeah, this isn't, uh, I'll be honest with you, no offense, it's just not that strong of a Tyrannus like I'm used to facing. But I'm still having problems getting him down. <laughs> so maybe it is. Jeez. No, my, you don't. I'm actually having problems killing him. I'm thinking maybe it's an HP Tyrannism. Because, uh, yeah, he didn't hit very hard. Unless I missed the crit or something. But, holy shit, uh, my Bella is kind of low. Uh-oh. I just gave five stacks. All right, come on. Let's remove his attack buff at least. Hopefully, he's going to keep targeting Bella. That's the problem. Or maybe that's a good... Jeez. Well, looks like uh, this is going to be it. <laughs> Let's see if we can get this win still, though. We could still win this. Uh, we're going to need some 
Some nice procs from Vertihile. We got to get this. Damn, this lightning number down. And yeah, you know what? I, I knew the kill target should have been this Emperor. And, you know, right off the bat, I got some nice damage on the Druid. And, and I, I was thinking he wasn't ruined right, but maybe he was. Because, yeah, that, I lost my Bella. I lost my Bella. And, well, now this is probably going to be it. All right. That's it. <laughs> Shout out to Tuan Shubao. Man, congratulations on that uh, light, dark emperor. I mean, the dark lightning emperor. Uh, he's awesome, man. I wish I had him. But yeah, congratulations. Shout out to Tuan Shubao from the Kestrel Guild. So I promise you six fights, and you're going to get six fights with or without a Bella. <laughs> I checked everywhere, and... Uh, I'm probably going to lose, but I said, fuck it. We're going to see if we can two-man something. And this might have been my best option. The thought process is Vertihal can self-heal with skill one. Veromos can heal every time he cleanses. If we get a lucky stuns on the Theo, maybe we can win. <laughs> Let's see how it goes. All right, man. I forgot I was recording already. All right, so because of the will, I'm, I mean, obviously inverted being a fire, I, I'm not going to hit this seal. But, uh, you know, like I said, my Vermos is on damage, so I think I have a chance. I thought I had a chance. <laughs> that's going to be it. Uh, uh, that's going to be it for this video, guys. I will show you the runes in just one second. I am not going to give up just like that okay now i am because theo is pretty strong uh so yeah there you go so bg my tom from the kestrel guild uh shout out to you i could definitely not two man your defense let's just say that <laughs> all right so these uh these are my vertihouse runes uh, I think you guys might have seen him in another video. I will be switching them around maybe. I don't know. He probably doesn't need Will. I want to get him on Revenge for next season's RTA. But for now, he's working okay on Will. All right, now this is my second Awakened Bella. Bella is fully skilled. I actually did double mine. It was my first second Awakening. I thought she was going to be amazing. Uh, she's not maybe amazing for RTA purposes like I thought, but she's... Or he, I, I don't know why I always call him she, but he is very, very good. So Violent Nemesis, uh, these are the stats, plus 22,000 HP. Uh, it's, pre uh, it's a pretty good set. Uh, it works really well, except versus the Dark Lightning Emperor, right? And then uh, Mr. Showtime himself from this uh, video. Uh, he's actually in storage, so we'll be right back with his runes. <coughs> All right, so he's out of still. He is plus 13,000 HP, 957 attack, plus 97 speed. 60 crit, 143 crit damage, 37 accuracy. He is also violent nemesis. He is a uh, speed, crit damage, attack. So he's getting all of the HP from substats, as you can see. Uh, damn, that's a really bad run. But uh, yeah, this one's decent. Um, they're not even maxed. Uh, I do use them a lot. Like I said, I usually use them in Siege. And... Uh, yeah, usually in Siege. And he performs really well, man. He performs really well. Um, I just think it's a fun team to use. So there you go, guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Maybe, you know, this little trip down memory lane when Bella, Veromos, Verde were the meta. And if you didn't know that they're still OP, now you know. You know?